everybody, my name is Nathan Vader, and today I've got a parcel. This was sent to me by my friends at Fnatic. Yes, believe it or not, I have friends. And they sent me a parcel, I believe, filled with Jurassic Park 30th anniversary merchandise that they are selling right now. So, uh, without further ado, let me get my uh, Kniffer and get Kikutig. Cutting. Knificut. Cutting. We're just going to cut it. Okay, the tape is broken. Let us get inside. Oh, so got some uh, packaging. I always like packaging. Keeps things safe while in transit. So what I'll do, I'll get everything out. Just have a quick look. Can't help it. Ooh, cheeky coin. Oh, very nice. Uh, what else we got here? Ooh, ooh, is this like another ingot thing? Yes, I did like the last ingot they made. Very, very nice. Ooh, 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 ooh. I'm loving this colour scheme, the green, the red and the yellows, oh yes, what's this, antique edition, just like me, I'm an antique edition, opening weekend ticket, very nice, ooh, 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 Okay, so first up, let's have a look at this. It's the limited edition Ingot Vehicle ID card. New, 1,993 worldwide. Authorized personnel only, just me. It's got a really nice little window there showing you the Ingot. Jurassic Park logo, the classic yellow background version, and the JP30 logo in the top corner. Love that. Never going to get bored of seeing that. Need more of that. Finished in a lovely green, red, and yellow fading there, just like the Ford Explorers had. Limited to 1,993, a worldwide, individually numbered, display stand included enamel metal card. And there's the Fnatic logo. And this lovely decoration going around the edge, much like you saw on the park maps that they had in the film. So so if we take this out, it's a nice fit as well. Oh yes, very shiny, very glossy. I almost feel bad about touching it because once it's been touched, the fingerprints will be everywhere and it's gonna be really hard to get them off. Or oh, there's a bit of weight there, yeah. Very nice. It's a sign of quality, I always find. Oh, got stuff on the back. Yeah, it's a sign of like quality when you've got like a good weighted item very nice uh and a nice sort of dark finish going around the edge and oh my goodness is that my number number three it's gotta be nothing else wow that's probably one of the lowest numbers i've ever had crikey uh oh right okay so we've got some stuff on the back that's cool please keep walkie talkie on your person at all times in emergency uses one nine nine three to contact the security team please make sure that hard hats are worn at all times whilst on shift uh please make sure equipment is returned back to base after each use please wear the correct footwear whilst on shift throughout the park I love this as well, the old caution keep windows upside, which you saw hanging from, uh, I think it was the Loposaurus paddock as they were driving through on the tour. And again, that nice Jurassic Park logo with the yellow background and 93. Very nice little touches. I do love all of this. This is very nice. I haven't seen anything like this before. Uh, so that's very cool indeed. And of course it comes with the display stand as well. And with these, it's very simple to construct these stands. It's simply just a push in and push down. And once you've got that there, what you've got to do, get your ingot, place it in, and there you go. Beautiful. All right, what we got next? We've got this, the Antique Edition Opening Weekend Ticket. Limited again to 1,993 worldwide. With the JP30 logo at the top there, the Jurassic Park logo in that top there. And you've got this lovely window showing you the ticket in all of its antique glory. Again, you've got this lovely banding going around the edge of the box. And again, it is limited to 1,993 worldwide embossed metal ticket, individually numbered, display stand included. And uh, there's the Fnatic logo again there. Uh, without further ado, let me get my knife and very carefully get this plastic off here so we can get inside. Yeah, I think I've got enough purchase on that there to pull it away. Oh, 
Okay. It's coming. It's coming. Oh, case. Okay, it's got this lovely sort of dark foam to hold it in place. Very swish. Oh, let's pull it out. And there's the display stand. We'll come back to that in a sec. But let's look at this first. Oh, yes. I love stuff with like a patina like that on there. It's very smart. It's very old. Um, but yeah, we've got here. So opening weekend, an adventure 65 million years in the making. Uh, VIP helicopter ride to Isla Nublar. Uh, first ever public access to uh, safari tour. Complimentary refreshments at visit center. VIP ticket admits one adult. Opening weekend. And it's got entry 16th to the 7th, 1993. Opens at 9 a.m. Admit one. Customer. Oh, I got number two. Wow. Wow. Again, I've never had anything that low until like today. Wow, 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 wow. Thank you very much. And you've got these really nice Jurassic uh, images. Uh, it's like uh, embossed, I guess. It's like very, it's all raised. So you can see the Jurassic logo with some foliage there. Very nice. And what's on the back? Oh, I just said you've got a, an InGen logo in the top as well, I forgot to mention. And on the back, you've just got the Jurassic Park 30th anniversary logo with the Amblin legal bump at the bottom there. Very, very nice. And again, it's, you know, very weighty. It's it feels quality, I'm not gonna. And same again, this stand is really easy to set up. It's simply a push in and lock down, and that's it. Then you get your antique ticket, and there you have it. Beautiful, very, very beautiful. And next we've got this, a limited edition coin. Again, it is limited to 1,993 worldwide. And you've got there, it looks like Ian Malcolm resting there. Uh, life finds a way, it certainly does. Uh, JP30 in the corner, and again, this fantastic colouring going on. And on the back, it says limited to 1,993 worldwide, individually numbered, embossed on both sides. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. There'll be sync on the other side of the coin, very nice. Uh, yeah, so let's get this one open. Let's see what's going on. Be very careful with this because I do want to put these back in their packaging. Is there anything hidden in there? Is it just it's just a sleeve? Got excited there for nothing. <laughs> okay, it gets it comes in a little plastic case, so it's safe. Very nice. So once you've got your coin out of the packaging, it does come with a coin protector case as well, which is pretty easy to take off. Uh, you're left with this coin, which is very nice indeed. You've got a silhouette there of Ian Malcolm with the quotation Life Finds A Way underneath it and a lovely JP30 logo in the top corner. And on the back, you've got another quotation there, an adventure 65 million years in the making, June 11th, 1993, with the silhouette there of the T-Rex skeleton. Very, very nice indeed. And my number for this is 895. I don't mind if it's a high number or a low number, it's just a cool freaking coin. And last but certainly not least is this poster. Now I didn't really get to look at it properly because I didn't want to disturb it while I was getting it out of the roll. So what I'm gonna do is try and flatten it out and then us guys can have a look at it properly. And last but certainly not least is this really nice Jurassic Park poster. It is Mr. DNA. How to make a dinosaur with Mr. DNA, in fact. Uh, I love this poster. It sort of gives me the vibes that it would be hanging up in the visitor center somewhere, like an information area where it would give a simplified explanation as to how the dinosaurs were created at Jurassic Park. And what I really love about this poster is it has an old school vibe, but they've also incorporated some of the stills from the animated short film that the guests were shown while on tour in the Jurassic Park Visitor Center. I think that's a really nice touch. So if you have a close up here, you can see the miner from the animated short film that's extracting the fossilized amber sort of ingot with the uh, mosquito inside. And uh, you've also got there the mosquito that sat on the dinosaur in the short film and sucked a bit of blood out. And you've also got the frog from the animated short there where it was uh, talking about how they were going to use some of the DNA code from the frog to fill in the gaps to create the dinosaur. And what you've got here is a list of how it comes to make a dinosaur. So you've got one, a mosquito feeds on the blood of a living dinosaur 100 million years ago. Two, find the fossilized amber with a mosquito trapped inside and then extract that DNA 
from the ancient mosquito. Three, use frog DNA to fill in the gaps in the genetic code. And then four, bingo, dino DNA, life finds a way. And I've just seen there's one of the dinosaurs there from that short animated film. That's fantastic. There's another little Easter egg there. Very nice. And you've got this wonderful Mr. DNA on the cover here with the old sort of blueprint that you saw in the animated short. Also here when it was talking about how it was doing the build-up of the dinosaur on a blueprint scale. You've got it here in the background. So it's very, very nice. I like that. It's very smart. And it's got this old school vibe to it, which I'm really digging. And on the back here, it's written in pencil number 65 of 995 that's very nice but not only and if it didn't get any cooler you also get a small certificate from universal telling you that this is an official product and it is in a limited quantity and it tells you there that it is 65 of 995 so that's really nice i think what i'll probably do is get that framed and have that put inside the frame so uh i don't ever lose that that's very nice but that's a very cool piece there and there you go, that's everything that I got from Fnatic today. Very, very nice stuff. Uh, couldn't be happier. Really love this poster. The coins always are a charmer for me. These ingot things, they just, I don't know, it's because they're so well built. They feel so hefty that uh, I just, I fall in love with them. I love holding these things, but they look even better on their little stands as well. Very nice. And of course, the packaging that they come in is just second to none. I mean, everything's got this lovely red, green and yellow finish. You know, that always grabs my attention because it's the old classic 93 look. And that is what I like. And also this ticket. Love the old patina. I love anything with a bit of age to it. And uh, this is certainly a bit of me. And of course, this poster is awesome. Very, very nice. And I couldn't thank Fnatic enough for sending all this stuff to me. Uh, I'll leave a link to Fnatic's website so you can go check this stuff out for yourself. And you can pick up some of this fantastic gear. Anyway, my name is Nathy Vader. Thank you very much for watching. I post on Instagram and Twitter almost daily. And of course, it's always Jurassic related. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. Yes. Mm, yes, I'm taking my ticket. I'm going to the island. See ya. Bye.